All right, guys, so the next page we want to create is the contact page. Let's click contact. And now we need to add a map and a contact form. So to add our map, we can go to Google Maps right here in Google. Click on Google Maps, and then we're going to look up our business. So here's my home right here in uh, Lake Calhoun, AKA Lake Bidet Makaska. No one can really pronounce it though, it's kind of tough. Um, but where I usually work is at Chelsea Market. I guess it's becoming less and less because I don't live in New York anymore. But when I'm around, you can find me here, you know, eating and bustling around. And to get your map location wherever you are, you just need to click Share, Embed a Map, and Google has created this little friendly iframe, which is perfect for WordPress. So just click in the iframe tab, and it'll highlight, and you can copy it, and then come back to Contact and Edit Page. And all you need to do is just go to the text tab to paste in some third-party code from Google and right-click and paste it. And beautiful. And while we're here, we're going to add a contact form. To do that, we need to open up our site in a new tab because we're going to go to the plugin library. So we're going to hit Dashboard, Plugins, and then we're going to Add New and do a search for contact form 7. All right, and then it's already active on our blog, so we just need to go to plugins. But if it's not active, go ahead and start using it. This is the most popular contact form plugin for WordPress, and I'll show you why. So we can just go to settings, and it's awesome because it gives us this default shortcode. You don't need to do any work, and less is more here. You just need to click on the shortcode like I just did, right-click copy, come back to a page and right click paste, make a space and voila, you have a contact form with a map. So I'm going to give this a little description right here. I'm just going to write, come visit us anytime and then feel free to reach out. And that's all you really need and update. And of course you can be more elaborate if you want, if you want to write a little more or some cute little note. But we can just view page and see that the basics of our contact page are perfect now. We have a working map that someone can search right here in line with your blog. They don't have to go anywhere to check out your location. Or maybe see some nearby restaurants like, ooh, bathtub gin, that sounds good. Or someone can just write to you in your contact form beneath your map. Beautiful. Let's test it out. So when someone writes in their name, like James, which is my alter ego, and then their email, dearblogger.org, subject, um, blog post, and then message like, hey, I want to write a post for you because your blog is becoming so popular, you're going to get guest posts. Then they click send. It'll say thank you. So that's how it works. Nice confirmation message, super professional. And then when we go to Gmail, and I just got it on my phone, in fact, right here, you're going to see a new message from your website saying exactly what someone wrote to you. So perfect. That's how people can reach out to you, super professional, and it all works. And voila. So in addition to our map and form, every contact page, I think, should have a picture of something pleasing and usually it's just a picture of someone on a computer that works um, just to sort of incentivize someone to write to you or a picture of you writing to them. So let's go to Pixabay and let's get one of those such images. So let's look up workspace. That seems to be a really good keyword on Pixabay. Then you're going to get any number of cool computer photos and you can just choose whichever one is most appropriate for you. Or if you want, go ahead and create your own stock photo, you know, taking a picture of your own desk. And you can also click into a picture and go ahead and like categorize it deeper to find the perfect one. So I really like this picture because it's a startup and it shows people like actually doing work. But if you look hard enough, you'll see other photos from our videos or even from like demo WordPress themes as well, like Sydney, for example. So I'm gonna grab this photo, free download. Download, give it a title and save it, and now come back to our contact page, edit page, 
So you can add an image right here to the page itself, or you can add a featured image. Let's see what happens if we set featured image. Upload, select. Grab our working blogger. Then set the featured image and update the page. And we can view the page and it looks good. All right, so our contact us page is done.